Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Pool of Radiance. Once again, I am Ald Dragon, and um, I actually realized that uh, I should probably go get some, go get my rewards from uh, the county clerk, uh, the city clerk. So let's see what is, and we'll see what is also available. All right, let's see what my current rewards are. You have cleared the area next to the evil temple. Here is your reward. And. Oh, I got less platinum this time, but gems. I would actually rather get gems. The council has the council was pleased by the elimination of the thieves in Covell Mansion. Here is your reward. Actually, I'd rather have items. All right. Congratulations! You may keep all you found in the Temple of Bane as a reward. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Nomads, large tribe of kobolds. Find the source of the river's pollution and end it. Hmm. Okay. So all three of those are outside of the city. So, in other words, after I go train, I should be going outside of the town. Outside town and see what's up. I don't think anyone's uh, ready, but let's train. No. Nope. Oops, no, I do not want to quit the doors. Yay! I can get Fireball! Yep, let's train. Yay! And not enough experience, okay. And... Hmm? Hmm. Thought that was enough. Oh. Okay, well... Head to the inn. And uh, let's go ahead and start memorizing spells. Actually, let's scribe some spells. Already got that. Let's get that, that, that. Okay. Let's go for another magic missile. And fireball, yay! Best spell in the game, by far. Okay, let's see. All right, um, I've got a few other scrolls. Let's see what is, what is on these scrolls. Let me trade that to. Yep. All right. Oh, whoops. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong person. Duh. Dead, cause disease, prayer. Snake charm, silence, 15 foot radius, bless. I'm gonna have to use some of those as preparatory spells before combat one of these days. Alright, um. I mean, might as well equip the uh, ring of feather falling. I'm going to uh, give this mace back to her. Let me 
me check my movement rates on oh. Alright, we should be good to go. Let me, uh, actually, I'm going to pause it while I go uh, fix up my uh, mage's hit points. I'll be right back. And we're back. Okay. So, we've basically cleared out all the um, uh, blocks of the city other than um, Valjevo Castle itself, uh, the gatehouse, and the Lingen Graveyard. So, um... We now have two options of what, well, not two options, um, we, we have a couple uh, missions that we can go for outside of town. Um, there's the Cobalt, which is actually quite difficult, I do not want to get do that until Moonshadow is, has at least one Fireball spell. Um, there is a battle, uh, there is the Nomad Camp, I can go do that. And then there is um, clearing up the river. Um, I think I'll start with the nomad camp. Uh, that will probably be easier. And I'm going the wrong way. So let's take the passenger dock. Let's go to the bay. You board a boat. Okay, we'll leave. Um, leave. So, uh, let me. Oops. In camp. Save. Save as A. Okay. Um, random encounters suck in the wilderness. I hate them. I really, really hate them. Anyway, this is the wilderness. It's kind of interesting. You're surprised by a group of displacer beasts. Let me see if I can flee. Dang. <sighs> hate dealing with monsters. Alright, well, random encounter, so I'm going to pause it. I'll be back after this battle is over. Okay, and I'm back from that uh, battle. I got 870 experience points from all those Displacer Beasts. But as you can tell, I also took quite a bit of, well, not quite a bit of damage, but a fair amount of damage. Um, and I had to use some spells. So, I'm not pleased with that. I mean, it's a stupid random encounter. Alright, let's see, I did a stinking cloud, and stinking cloud, alright. Now there is some dam some risk of encountering enemies, but I'm gonna risk it. I think I'll just heal her for now. And I'll lose these spells. Oops. Wasn't a spell I intended to lose, but I will. Let me get my prayer back. Oops. Yeah, it was prayer. Okay. One hit point, come on. Oh, one 
again? Jeez. It really needs more healing spells in this game. Yay! We ended up resting for a whole day. <laughs> kind of ridiculous. There we go. Okay. Let me save it. And I found something that I have no idea what it was. You've stumbled upon a large nomad camp. Will you enter it? Yes, I will. Hmm, it is night. Alright. Let's take a look at the area. Oh, I can't area. That's crummy. You trip on a wire to the accompaniment of bells tinkling. After a moment, there is a commotion ahead of you. Let's advance cautiously. A crowd of scruffy-looking nomads of something... Watch. Stop going so fast! You can see children peering out of the tent openings, only to be pushed back inside by their mothers. The nomads wait for you to make the first move. Let's parlay. The biggest, meanest, dirtiest nomad pushes his way to the front of the crowd. Five other nomads stand around him as if to protect him. The bigger nomad, apparently the chief or headman, acknowledges you with a nod. We will give you a feast in your honor tomorrow. Will you join us? Wow, a feast in our honor just for showing up? Sweet. You must be tired from your travels. We will provide you with lodging. He leads the way to a hut which is hurriedly being cleared of its occupants. Doo -doo. These huts look like they're bamboo. <laughs> Here you may rest. So... Let us... Well, I don't think I need to memorize any spells. Nope. 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 Let's rest for uh, one day. Rest is rudely interrupted. The headman walks up to you, uh, something or other. Games for our guests. Ah, it's going so fast. You are treated as honored guests for the rest of the day. There are contests of strength and skill in your honor. As night falls, the nomads build a huge campfire in the center of the camp. The whole tribe gathers for the feast. After the feast, there is dancing and wild celebrations. During the festivities, the chief, his tongue loosened, loosened by drink, tells you of the dangers of the region. Make Hassad Awal's talk. Entry 55 in your journal. Alright, um... Still got a minute to go, but I'm not sure if I can get this whole thing in. Let's see. Uh, maybe I can. Okay. Deliver it as you sit around the campfire. You must be aware of the many dangers in this region. Several days walk to the west. There is a pyramid of evil. It has long been avoided by all sensible men. To the southeast is a lair of many ferocious hobgoblins. The areas to the southwest are inhabited by evil men, buccaneers, marauders, and soldiers of an evil empire far to the west. And all good folks avoid the swamps to the east. Nothing but danger grows in the swamps. Okay. And, uh, no, i still got some time left. Henman seems very uneasy as he continues to speak. He practically begs you to stay for a few more days, rather than leave in the morning as you planned. My scouts have seen evidence of a large band of kobolds in the vicinity. I worry about my people. If you would stay until they pass, I would appreciate it. Well, sure, we can. Please think about it overnight. After a while, the festivities end and you are escorted to your lodging. And here I will end the episode.